Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum and welcome to another great tutorial. <laughs> okay, uh, is tutorial we will learn how you can make a uh, web button. Bana sakte hain. Well, what is your requirement for a web button? The size, you know, better than me. Uh, I this tutorial ko uh, achhi tarah samjhane ke liye. I'm gonna go and work on 1024 by 768 and I'm gonna go and zoom in with this and I'm gonna extend my file like this so you could see uh, this video very clearly okay uh, this is a simple button which I will prepare and what I'm going to do is I'm gonna go and take uh, the rectangle with the rectangle tool or you can press U from your keyboard you can keyboard set U press ka sakte if you wanna go and select this uh, rectangle Tool, okay. Or I will take a selection longa like this. All right. Okay. Uh, सबसे पहले मैं अपने keyboard से control press करूँगा और मेरे पास यहाँ पे जो layer है, the thumbnail layer जो आप ये देख सकते हैं, इस rectangle की उस पे click करूँगा and it's gonna go and make a selection around this box and I will go to select and save this selection and I'm gonna go and name it to B as a button and press OK I have this selection ko save kar liya hai and I'm gonna go and uh, do something like select and deselect ya phir aap apne keyboard se control D bhi press kar sakte hain alright ab main is layer pe right click karunga and I'm gonna go and open these blending options which are real cool और जो सबसे पहले मैं इसमें ऑप्शन यूज करूंगा दैट स्ट्रोक आई एम गोइंग टू गिव इट स्ट्रोक स्ट्रोक ऑफ द कलर दिस ब्लू कैन ऑफ ब्लू प्रेस ओके इसका जो साइज है आई एम गोइंग टू पुट 1 इट्स वेरी आई मीन लाइट स्ट्रोक एंड पोजीशन इज आउटसाइड द सेम ब्लेंडिंग मोड इज नॉर्मल सेम नो चेंजिंग विद ओपेसिटी fill color I mean this this gonna be a so, solid color okay uh, iske baad jo main second layer style iske upar uh, try karunga that's the gradient overlay yes I'm gonna go and uh, give it a colorly style like two colors like this and then whatever you choose this is these are my favorite colors so I'm gonna go and use them or I'm gonna go and press OK. OK. Uh, iske baad main is pe jo third apply karne laga hon layer style. That's gonna be the inner glow. Inner glow ko main check karunga and the, for the inner glow setting, the blending mode is gonna be the normal. And opacity goes to full 100% and the color. Oops, sorry. The noise, there is no changing with the noise. Is ko hum log zero pe rakhenge. And uh, the color goes to white. Press OK. Clear solid color mein istemal kiya hai. Alright, the elements. The technique is softer, that's fine. Uh, the source is edge. Okay, I'm not gonna go and use it in the center. I'm gonna go and use it at the edge. Choke is all the way down to 100. The size is gonna be the two. Why? अगर आप लोग मेरे इस ट्यूटोरियल को साथ साथ फॉलो करेंगे, तो आप देखेंगे कि the two size is gonna be very professional look for this buttons. और अगर मैं यहाँ पे स्ट्रोक खत्म करूँगा, so you cannot see the choke effect और size जो के inner glow से हम लोगों को मिला है. The quality, well, the contour is gonna be the same. And range and jitter is gonna be the same. You don't know the same range. And for the drop shadow, you can play with drop shadow, but not right now. Okay. And press OK to confirm this layer setting. And this is gonna be our cool buttons. But don't move your button. <laughs> okay. Now what I'm going to do is to go to select and load a selection. Okay, we have selection pehle And I'm gonna go and press OK. The B is selected. Alright, now you can see that we have taken the inner glow here. We have our selection here. 
So I'm going to go and play with slash and select modify and contract. Yes. I'm going to go and do it like two and press enter. Now you can see that my selection has uh, two points that has reduced because I have the size of the choke ka size rakha tha, that was two. All right. So what I'm going to do is to take uh, this my rectangle marquee tool or here I options my third option has subtract from selection and uh, I'm gonna go and subtract some area from the selection like this okay I have selection jo hai, wo is button ke approximately half mein hai. I'm gonna go and make a new layer or I'm gonna go and fill it with the white with pressing alt and uh, backspace to apply my background color all right now come to select and deselect this selection make sure that you have a layer that is white that's selected and its opacity hai, that's gonna be I mean that's really depends on you you can put like so many sizes like 30 like 20 that really depends on you but what I like is 20 that's where that's really very fine okay that's fine that's great now if you like to play more agar aap is button ke saath aur bhi kuch karna chahte hain so you can go on and uh, add this drop shadow but for me drop shadow uh, the blending mode will be multiply and overlay and opacity sorry sorry opacity is, is going to be the 75 angle is going to be 120 with uh, use global light or distance is going to be the 2 and the size is going to be 3 all right, you will see a great shadow. Agar aap iska blending option off karenge, so you could see the effect, beautiful effect. And I'm gonna go and name it. And I'm gonna write something like www dot. Oops, sorry, this is the button. So I'm gonna say download. All right. The font which I'm using is the standard uh, Time New Roman, which I mean, the other logos are available. Hoti hai. And I'm gonna put it in here. Make sure that your download text hai, that's on the very top, like this. And you can see a nice uh, button which you can, you can go on and use in your projects, in your website, or anywhere in your presentation, a CD presentation. This is a nice, simple button you can use. Uh, try this at home. Yes, you can try this at home. <laughs> because other videos may hamlo ka something and don't try this at home. Or uh, please, please, please comment me. I mean, comment me all about these videos. Or uh, if you want to use Adobe Photoshop professionally, if you want to use professionally, so go on and buy uh, a DVD course which is on www.nasimjave.com. Yes. And uh, I hope that this tutorial has helped you a lot uh, if you are a new user to Photoshop. And uh, thank you very much. Please comment or write me the email at uh, oops, asimjavet45 at gmail.com. Oops. Thank you very much and keep looking this channel of YouTube.